actually played against him in friendlies, and I didn't realize what Pac-Man could do, and this man kind of uh, ran all over me, so. Yeah, he he knows a lot about Pac-Man. He, he knows his tech, he knows, he knows a lot of good ledge setups, too. I feel like Pac-Man mains are so proud, right? Because, like, their character is not super good, but they have all these cool ideas and stuff like that, and they make it work. Yeah, it's, it's, I, it's what I love about Pac-Man. He's got all these cool ideas. He's really creative with all his setups, but it's just like, Shield just beats it, beats it, everything. Completely. Yeah, that's the sad part about it, right? Everything just has so much counterplay to it. We're starting off here, sup with a nice little string there, uh, kind of making Spirit back off and be a little scared off the start here with his floats. Yeah, he's got, yeah, making a Spirit have to kind of adapt to. Um, what is that? A melon? I always get super that's confused a, what that is. I think it's an a melon. avocado. It's a melon or an avocado. It's something. I don't know what it is. All I know is it hurts. Yeah, and it's slow. It's super slow. You gotta be and just prepared for it. The apple is really good. It always go always goes a downward angle, and if it hits you, it sends you like in an upward angle. Oh wow, that's actually really interesting. So it probably sets up for more aerials and stuff like that. That's so, aerials at lower percents. It can kind of it can lead to early kills if people aren't expecting it. Yeah. Fire hydrant shenanigans coming out right now. Ooh, uh oh. Oh, he does get the second hit, but it doesn't really stun him. It, it, it hit him, but didn't hit him. Yeah, it was very interesting. It wasn't the sweet spot that. I guess there's a sour spot on that. That's kind of gross. Oh, Ooh. that's one of the ledge subs I was talking about. Very good. Yeah, forcing the hydra to come out there and force him off the ledge because the dimbone was going away to down smash. Yeah, the only option I don't. I. Actually, jump? I think that covered. I think that did cover all options. Yeah, I think it covered jump since he was on there so long. He could have jumped earlier. Maybe. Yeah. yeah. I Maybe. think he had to be quicker with his option there. Probably. Ooh, okay, so let's see if he can hit this hydra to put pressure on Sup. He decides to actually not to go for it, which now Sup's gonna take advantage of it. Yeah. Anytime you're playing against Pac-Man, you want to try and take advantage of that fire hydra if you can. Yeah, it hurts, it, man. Yeah, it can lead to so much stage control for you if you have control of it. Yeah, I mean, like, right now, look at that. Like, all that room even got a little bit of extra charge there for Pac-Man. We got a stitch face on the field. Oh, oh dear, we do. And uh, Sup has definitely recognized it. Yeah, he's got to be careful. Go. I want to see Pac-Man take it and actually do some sick combos. Oh, never mind. Like, oh, he's got to be careful with that grabs. Spirit kinda, probably could have probably could have punished was fair there, actually. Yeah, just I think he was scared to, like, fall it too quick because he couldn't do it while the float was happening. So I think he was scared to fall it and cancel it. Ooh, that pulled was him into it. That was a cool setup there. Yeah, Sup really oh. showing us. Uh, ooh, okay, yeah, that should be the kill yep, right good, there. Good, good from Spirit, recognizing he had a lot, plenty of time to get him punished off. Oh and no, we got the key. The key to success here. The key. Let's see. Uh. Oh! Oh! Oh, that was awesome. The key hit into fire hydrant. Key to hydrant combo. That was beautiful. Do we got a replay of that? New high score. We got a replay of that. That's at least 200 points right there. That's crazy. That's like 250. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, all right, here's that replay. So, yeah, that was cool how he did it. You know, he kind of read that. Yeah, he knew uh, he was. He knew Spirit was kind of panicked from rolling or jumping, so he kind of figured. He was like, okay, maybe he'll do a get up attack this time. Let's see how this works. And I liked how uh, it actually looked like that covered so many different things from the ledge there. The only thing I think that was actually going to be really good for him on the ledge was just chill. Just yeah, wait it out, just, right? Just wait down there, maybe kind of opt to hop back off and then grab for the ledge again. And maybe? it's kind of crazy, too, because uh, last time Sup did the mix-up where, oh, you wait? Now I punish you because you waited. This time he didn't wait and gets punished again. So I don't know if that's some like long-term mix-up ledge traps, but... If so, that's incredible. We do have the down tilt not getting tech there, so that's going to lead him to damage. Yeah, a definite weakness for Pac-Man, though, is his follow-ups aren't amazing sometimes if he's too far away. As you notice, he kind of just threw out a dash attack there in neutral and, you know, didn't get any follow-ups on yeah, it. Yeah, that was about it. He doesn't have the air speed or the ground speed, really, to make up a lot of that ground. No, his hit Pac-Man's game is stage control and keeping it. Ooh. Oh, and just throwing out that key. He, I think he kind of forgot about it. I kind of did, realistically. Nice same. Uh, I even forgot he had the key. Ooh, the fire hydrant pressure right now. Yeah, going to duck it with the down tilt. Pretty smart there, actually. I like that. Yeah, I want to see Spirit use more turnips, though. I kind of just, all I'm really seeing him go for is kind of fishing for dare hits to hopefully land land dare to fair. Yeah, uh, he's looking, he's definitely going for a little bit of down tilt and dare, which is kind of, you know, the peach staple, right? Leads into so many different things. But in this game right now, when you're this far behind, switching it up definitely will probably help out a little bit. Ooh, that fire had just dropped right on her dome. All right, he's got to mix up the ledge options. Oh, and yeah, that caught, that, yeah. 
Meow is dead, everyone. Know, he got called out like three times on the he ledge. Did. It makes me sad because they were all different call outs. They weren't even like pretty the same much. trap. Pretty much. Some have like for, taking that pretty cleanly, actually. Yeah, Spirit's Peach, you know, definitely some uh, pretty decent Peach, you know. He had some good.